would like to speak about something I'm very passionate about, which is purpose. I personally believe that a human being who travels life without finding his purpose has just existed on earth but hasn't lived. So what do I think purpose is? I think that purpose is finding the one thing that makes you come alive, makes you want to go to your place of work, whatever it is that you want to call work, and function even in your darkest days and not want to give up even when you have the hardest challenges. And I think that when we find purpose, it's when we find something that is greater than our own self-absorbed narcissistic existence. So let me make an example. I could say that I love sweeping the street and I'm doing it because I need the money. But once I actually realized that sweeping the street has become something that I enjoy simply because I enjoy how people feel when they walk in something clean and the influence and the impact it makes in their lives, then you know that actually I have found something that makes me come alive. Whether somebody has thrown piles of rubble, um, I'm not going to complain as much as I should or as, as much as somebody who doesn't enjoy what, what, what sweeping the street means. So for me, I think, uh, finding purpose is actually finding something that makes you wake up in the morning and say, I'm going to do this. And I'm one person who searched for some time in my life and I wanted to find my purpose, but I wasn't sure what my purpose is. All I knew is that I love people and all I knew is that I want to make a difference. But when I went to university and I had what they call maybe a serendipity moment or an aha moment, um, that was the moment when I chose a study, or maybe the study chose me, but I chose the study of understanding human brain and behavior. When I chose the study, I didn't know how much it actually resonated with whom I was inside. I want to believe that maybe my purpose found me because I was letting out the energy that is saying, I want to make a difference and I love helping people and at some point I may, I may have wanted to be a, um, um, a social worker and my dad had told me to be a psychologist but I think the two married each other because psychology works on the mind and uh, uh, social worker is more of community and with neuroscience I found that my purpose is being lived on both these um, studies which is psychology and, 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 and social work. So as a neuroscientist, as I've said already, we study the human brain and we look at the behavior that is elicited by the brain. And sometimes we look at the behavior and then we say what could be happening in the brain. So this kind of study is not just lab based, but it actually impacts communities because our communities or our societies are relatively made up of human behavior. So the way that we actually impact our societies and our communities, we impact them in the sense that the issues that our communities are burdened with, they can be observed, taken back into the laboratory environment, mimicked, and even human disorders and even human diseases. These can be taken back into the lab, mimicked, try to find out if we can find a drug that can treat these disorders and send it back into the pharmaceutical environment if possible and then we're building up more and more on the knowledge of trying to understand and solve the problems that are medical as well as social at a daily basis and for me that is finding purpose because i truly enjoy working on the human brain working on behavior impacting my students and putting out information to the public that is going to make their lives better and different.